Hey guys, News Now California, out in the city of Culver City. I'm out here today at the Culver City Senior Center. This is a very nice building. The facility is very well maintained and it's great to have this center for the uh, seniors. And hopefully they're gonna respect my right to film in public. So they have computer class information. That's great. Help the seniors with the computers and technology with the uh, Culver City High School volunteers here. That's very nice. Then they sell uh, these hand uh, knitted socks and hats. And That's a nice looking hat or beanie. That is nice. So all this money goes to uh, the VA Children's Hospital Meals Delivery Program. That's very nice. This is a uh, sculpture of Walt Whitman donated by renowned Artist Milton Hebald, May 2008. Socks are $18 to $24. This is a very nice reading room. Uh, here they've got some uh, posters talking about trips the seniors can take to Iceland, Washington, D.C. Chumash uh, Casino Resort, Queens Hotel Casino, and the Ronald Reagan Library and Museum. It's pretty nice. Administrative offices are in here. They've got uh, books for people. Very nice. Well, the rules and regulations, number four is do not engage or threaten physical violence in any form. It's a good thing they're telling the seniors uh, to avoid that. We don't want any uh, seniors fighting. That's for sure. Denise, you said I want And we have dining areas down here. A lot of people dining. Yeah. Yeah. There it is. And then we've got Siglavia. Parking permits. So they have coyotes here. Culver City Police Department notice of coyote management. Okay. Somebody's already gotten nervous. 
Going to the back room. So walk-in passport acceptance. Today is Friday, March 8th, 8 to 2. This is great. They provide that for the seniors. And the UCLA memory training course. Let me uh, repeat it. I forgot what I said. The UCLA memory training course. Oh yeah, that's what I said. Can you call us? Can you call us to see if you can? Um, Cameras, you cannot film anything. Um, can you call Armando? What law is that? Can you film? You just told me I can't. Now no, you're you can't somebody? because I know you're filming me, and I know I feel uncomfortable being on camera without my permission. So therefore, if any was any release, you you're have public. no. I'm in public. Right. Once you're in public, you have no expectation of privacy. Well, I. And you came up to me while I was recording anyway. Right? Not a problem. I'm not gonna engage. Have you a good just one. you just told me I can't film. Now you're asking. I can film in here, man. It's open to the public. I understand, but not me. Sure I can. Anybody that's in public, I can film. But trust, I'm not going out to put all of these seniors in here. That's not my intention. If I wanted to do that, I could, but I don't, that's not my goal. Just me, man. Well, you walked up to me. I wasn't even right, filming no you. You don't have to get loud. You don't have to get loud. I'm not loud. You are getting loud. Well, that's your opinion. Just say Pay parking. Yes. Why is everybody getting nervous? No reason to get nervous. I'm just here filming in public. This is a great building. I want to share share this information for people that could never see what the senior center is about. That's a good goal, isn't it? Christina. Christina. So here we have a security officer saying that I can't film in here, but then he's checking. How you doing, boss?
See? Yeah, Everybody's all nervous, man. Crazy. I'm, uh, I'm doing a, a story. It's a beautiful building. Yeah. And uh, this lady's all nervous, calling security. He's telling me I can't film in here. Man. I can film in here. It's open to the public. Right, right, right. And that's what I do. I go out and record to teach people, educate people that we have a right to record in public. I mean, I'm not here to film seniors. I'm not doing that. Hopefully, I come in here. I've got a YouTube channel. I go out to educate the public that we have a right to film in public. I film the police to make sure they don't abuse you, me, everybody else out there. And uh, it's just, these guys don't know what they're, they're talking about. Man. So let me show you what Yeah, I'm gonna check it out right now. <laughs> hey man, you have a good day. Hey, get that all clarified? I can film in here, man? Like to bark orders, huh? That's what I thought. Here's the walk of shame, everybody. The walk of shame. Hey, how are you? I see, I see you yelling at the, towards the security guard. Is everything okay? Uh, yeah, who are you? I'm Armando. Yeah, yeah. Armando Abrego? That's correct. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice yeah, to meet you. Uh, no, uh, I'm just curious to... I'm, I'm, I'm just, first of all, I wasn't yelling at him. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I heard you from way back over here. That's what I was asking, but okay. I, I'm in here, Armando. Uh -huh. It's a beautiful building. Thank you, sir. I, I come, what's your position here? I'm the Senior Social Services Manager with the City of Culver City. Okay. My I name's prefer, Phil. Phil. I appreciate it. Nice, nice to meet you. Uh, what I do, Armando, is I go out and I educate the public. Okay. Do we have a right to film in public? Yes. I, I, I come in here. I've got no ill intent, no ill will. I'm, no. not, I'm not in here I, to film these senior people. God thank bless you. the senior. However... I'm not restricting you. I'm not. I, I appreciate that. No, yeah. he tried to. Oh, well, but I guess then, right? Uh, that's why I asked my staff to ask him not to. He's allowed to video do it. Another problem. He's enjoying the So well done, sir. That's what it's all about. Because uh, I tried to tell him. I guess she got nervous. Called you. You're handling it very professional. My whole intent is to educate the people the public that we have a right that's my whole intent is to educate the public we have a right to film in pu uh, public i also do all government agencies i'll do prisons deas police i have no hatred towards the police there's good and bad in every profession unfortunately right now with the police the bad yeah. make the look good look bad but this individual came up to me and he told me that i can't film in here and i told him it's open to the public i can he says well you can't film me and i tried to explain it to him and then he says can they film in here so you know, he just needs to be educated. I've got no ill will or hatred towards him, but the way you explained it to him, I appreciate it. Okay. You know, and, and, and I'm respectful, Armando. I'm not going up and doing this to you. I would never do that. Yeah, and, and I get it. I mean, I mean, you know, again, I'm on the clock, so... Yeah, well, then, you I'm, know. I'm, I'm, you're glad to see me, man. I'm taking you away from some stress, right? <laughs> sure. Right, right. Uh, but so anyhow, you, you, but welcome to the city of Culver City. Thank you. Thank uh, you. Again, yes, if, if you could just be mindful, again, there's people that prefer that you don't but I'm sure like you said you've done this a million times yeah you look, can educate look. Them, but but we'll we'll deal with with the contract company and we'll make sure we that's what it's all best. about that's just deal with that get them educated and like okay. I say God bless the seniors the last thing I want to do is be filming somebody and they get upset and they have a heart attack and I'm going to oh my god you yeah, know? it would be a good situation how old is this building uh, 17 years 17 yeah yes. so you are the hot head honcho guy um, well, I don't know about the head honcho guy, but I, head of I, I, One I, get of to, I get to help everybody, the other okay. employees, make this all happen. Okay, okay. Well, it's, it's great. And I appreciate your professionalism. I appreciate you not only educating the contracting uh, security, but also the ladies, too. 
but, but, but understand again, right, that, that they have the ability or the right to be able to say, I prefer you not. You well, know? they didn't say anything. I know they didn't, but again, right? They, just... they can just come up to me cordially and say, hey, what are you doing? And I'll get into a cordial discourse. But instead, what she decided to do was scurry around and call and she heighten is, the alert. But, but understand she has the right to, to feel nervous because don't, we don't know you and you don't know us, right? So well, why doesn't she just say, hey, just a minute, you having a let, good day? I know, but let me finish though. So, so again, like you said, you have no ill intent. Right. Right. I, I, we don't read minds. Right, right. And again, like you said, you're filming. It's not. That's all I'm doing. So. So. Anyways, but have a blessed day and. Uh, you have a blessed day too, too. Armando. All right, nice pleasure. talking to you. Okay. Good luck with everything. You too. Take care. Let me know if you're going across the streets. I let him know you're coming. Bernard, let, me let me know what? He said, "Let me know if you're going across the streets. I let him know you're coming." Oh, that's part of it too. Uh, we. The, this is the city of Culver City, right? So there's a bunch, well, then there's you, you, 12, 12. I don't want to tell you, then you're going to yeah, blow yeah. my undercover, bro. 12, 12 different mm -hmm. facilities, so best it, of luck. It's okay. Thank you, sir. All right, ladies and gentlemen, there you had Armando, a true representative. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that uh, started off bad but ended well. Thank you, Armando, for being professional, for telling the security guard that I have a right to film in public and to walk away. And... Also, Armando will be calling up that contracted security company to let them know that. So kudos to Armando. Thank you, sir. All right, guys. So he says there's a facility over here. Let him know so he can let them know I'm coming. That, will, uh, that would not be a good idea, I told him. It would blow my undercover move, but we'll see. How are you doing today? Good. That senior center is nice. Yeah. Very nice. You go in there? Sometimes. Is the food cheap? The food? Uh, you pay like a few dollars. Below five dollars. That's not bad. Yeah. How old senior? 65 or 55? 55. Oh, that's good. Yeah. All right, you have a good day. You too. this facility that he said he would let them know I'm coming. Maybe if he did, they'll say, hey, welcome. Record anything you like. It's your right to record in public. Well, we can all have dreams and aspirations. I don't think that's going to happen. So what is this? This is the Western Hemisphere Marathon. They have a marathon in Culver City apparently and show all the uh, past winners. This goes back to 1948. Wow. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Let us enter, and hopefully this is not the lion's den. This is the Veterans Memorial Building for Culver City. This building is dedicated by a grateful people as a living memorial to those who, through unselfish service in the time of war, struggle to secure for all humanity the blessings of freedom and a world at peace, 1950. A rotunda, auditorium, refreshments. So all the information here, a lot of this is the same that was at the Senior Center. It's good information.
Okay, uh, I believe these are all the city council people that are currently... Uh, I believe these are all the current city council people. I could be mistaken, though. I could be mistaken, but I believe they are the current city council people. They have uh, a lot of brochures here of toxic uh, information, toxic to trash, Excuse me. start the ocean. Is this open to the public? Uh, yes, but you can't record inside. What law is that? The law of the facility. Okay, well that's a policy. Yeah. Right, and the policy doesn't trump the law. Okay, but you can't record in here. I'm sorry, I was just informed that. Who, who informed you that? Um, one of my coworkers. Okay, well she doesn't know the law. And I just came from your other facility. Which one? Right across the street. The senior center? Yeah. Okay. You know well, Armando? Not, yeah, well, you're not supposed to record, though. Yeah. No, you're misinformed. Okay, but uh, can you please stop recording? Because it's not, you're not allowed to record inside the facility. Right, but that, you're, you're saying that's their policy. And yeah. I, I know you, they're sending you out. Yes. And unfortunately, they're giving you wrong information. Anything open to the public, I'm allowed, you're allowed to record. Okay, that's their policy. They just don't want it recorded, but it's a legal right. I do this all the time. I'm not trying to be rude. You're, you're nice. You're coming up. But, but unfortunately, your co-worker is telling you that. Mm -hmm. And she's putting you in a bad situation because it's totally BS. I mean, I just came from the senior center, had a long talk with Armando about it. Okay. So the best thing, uh, my name's Phil, by the way. What's your name? Um, Gio. Gio? Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, yeah. I have no ill intent. No ill will. Uh, but these co-workers, everybody's afraid of a camera, and any... Geo, was it? Yeah. That's a different name. Oh, it's a nickname. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, my nickname's Shirley. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, that's a joke. Oh. Sense of humor. The ability to perceive humor or appreciate a joke. <laughs> so, anyways, Geo, I'm just trying to help you out. Somebody says that we can't record in here. She's wrong. So you can do what you want to do. I'm going to continue. If you, if you feel, you know, that you want to take it to a next level, whatever you want to do, you can do that. I mean, if you want to call the police, call the police. They'll come out, and they're going to tell you that everything I'm telling you is correct. I, I do this all the time. I, I know my boundaries. If, it, if I was doing something wrong here, mm -hmm. I wouldn't be here. But, see, it's open to the public. And you can do your own research. Once you leave your house, you have no expectation of privacy. Mm -hmm. And I'm not, you know, you approached me. I wasn't, you, you could tell I wasn't even filming you until you walked up to me. Mm -hmm. I mean, so, I don't know. It, um, it, it's, it's your decision, Gio, how you want to follow up with Okay, well, I was, I'm just letting you know what was told to me, so and I And I understand they're you. telling you bad information, and I feel bad for you, because oh, okay. they're giving you bad information to come out and deal with a guy that's doing a legally protected activity. This is totally legal. What, so, what is the reason for recording? Uh, my reason is I go out to educate the public that we all have a right to film in public, right? Nobody should be afraid of a camera. I, don't, I know my boundaries. Mm -hmm. I don't go into any secure areas, but I go out to all government agencies, publicly funded agencies. I record uh, the police to make sure that they don't abuse people's rights. Anything that the taxpayers are paying for, I, I record to make sure our tax dollars are spent wisely. It's all education based, you know? And hopefully when I go out, I don't get a reaction mm -hmm. telling me, like somebody's telling you, and that person that's telling you, obviously you must be in a higher position or something for her to tell you, mm -hmm. for you to come out. But I would suggest just for your clarification is do your own research. You don't have to believe me. I mean, do, do your own research and you're gonna say, hey, Phil was right. Okay, I understand. I will do the research, but can you just respect the policy of here? Of no, no, no. I, I'm not respecting the policy because the policy doesn't trump my right to record. That's the whole issue. They can't stop me from recording, and I'm not. I'm not going to respect any policy because it's not law, and that's my whole intent. Okay. Fine. So, we're at a standstill. Um, okay. So. 
I just don't know what else to tell you. This is all that was told to me. And sure. if I have to take further Yeah, that's steps, okay. You you can I do whatever you want. If you feel too. if you feel you need to call the police, uh -huh. call the police. Or if you need uh, you want to call Armando. That would be the quickest uh, uh, answer. Mm -hmm. okay. That would be the quickest. Just call Armando and say, hey, Phil's over here filming. Is, 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 it, is it legal for him to do it? He told us it's not. Armando? Mm -hmm. Armando just told you it's not? Well, he told us just to not have anybody record. This was even when I started working. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah. no. Oh, no. Well, maybe when you started working, which was maybe eons ago. Well, it didn't happen today. This isn't your first day working. No. I just had the conversation. I wouldn't. What did he say to you when you went over there? I had a long talk with him because the security guard told me I can't record, and then he came out and he educated the security guard. He can record. Leave him alone. And then I talked to him for ten minutes. So, you know, I would say it's better for you to call Armando than the police because mm -hmm. it's going to be a waste of taxpayers' resources yeah. for the police to come out and then they're, and then they're going to say, "Hey, Gio, what he's doing is perfectly legal." Okay. Just I'll call Armando. And I'll tell you what, because you're very nice, cordial, mm -hmm. and you can see I, I'm the same way with you. If, if, and I'm trying to help you. Mm -hmm. You can see that. I'm not being rude to you or anything. If you want to look really good, call Armando and just come back out and say, Hey, Phil, you were right, and you're going to look great. You don't have to do that. <laughs> you don't have to do that. I feel like I look okay right now. Oh, my God. Who do I think I am? But I'll just go and double check if anything. But You want to at least come back out yeah, here and talk I'll to me? I'll double check. I'll yeah. just talk to Double check and come back out. I'll, I'll wait for you. Okay. It's all good, Gio. Thanks. What are, what are these down here anyway? These are classrooms. Oh, they're all classrooms? Yeah. Good. Okay. Thanks. You're welcome. And you can tell, tell the people in there. They have no reason to fear a camera. Okay. Wow. These are some great pictures. All from the Wizard of Oz. Dorothy and the Scarecrow. There's Dorothy and the flying monkey and the wicked witch. I love those flying monkeys. And here is uh, a great one. We have the cowardly lion, the tin man, the scarecrow, Dorothy, and then all of the guards for the wizard. But I don't see Toto here. Wonder where Toto is. All right, pretty cool stuff. Pretty cool pictures. The European room. So they have all of these conference rooms, which is nice. And then they have all the uh, parking down here. Alrighty, well, I believe Gio went in here. Gio's not done. There's this guy. Look at this guy coming out. Hello, sir. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. I was told that you're filming here. Yeah. You can film in the rooms and then we're in the hallway. It's not a problem. Just letting you know. Uh, is Armando your boss? Yes, he is. All right. Yeah. Call, call him. because he He's across the street. Yeah, I know. I just talked to him. He said go over there and film. You can film in here, but not in the rooms. I'm not in the rooms. I'm just letting you know. Why would I go in the rooms? No, I'm just letting you know. Oh, you don't have to let me know. I know my boundaries. All right, thank you. Make sure you don't film me in the rooms. Hey, dude, I'm filming in this room from here. Okay. Yeah. See, I'm filming right here, the room you said don't film. 
I'm filming in here. I didn't say in. You said don't film in any rooms, dude. I didn't say. I'm I'm filming in all the rooms. Just remember that. Film in in all the rooms. What a numb nuts. There you go, buddy. I'm not filming in any rooms. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, I am. I'm filming you. Whoops, I am filming you. Yeah, it didn't go the way you thought it would go. Just barking nonsense. All right, well, I guess Gio doesn't want to come out. This Geo doesn't want to come out. Okay, Geo, I gave you your time to look good, but I guess you decided not to. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Geo doesn't want to come out and say I was right. That's okay, she got educated, just like her co workers did. All right, guys, that's what it is about, education. Armando probably got tired of the two phone calls from both of these individuals, but uh, thank you, Armando. All right, guys, I'm out of here. On to the next one. Bye now.